simple as this. You think you got crack? You think you got what it takes? Submit that shit to trial time. And we gon' ask the state what they think. But as long as you think you got crack, hey, you ain't got nothing to worry about. Of course, you might have your career on the line. You know what I mean? But it's all good, cause you coming to trial time, you probably ain't no career anyway. So you know what your charges is. It's attempting to sell crack. You come to my courtroom, goddamn it, you got to have crack. That's just gonna be a charge. And if you got crack, we gonna keep you for life. Because we need you around in Ice County like that. If your shit is whack, <laughs> Well, we just gonna let you go. Yeah. We gonna OR you on your own recognizance, okay? Now, the artists we got on the docket today come from a record label called No Trace Records. Name is uh, Young Measy, Lil Kane, Jabba, Foolish, and Elrond. They all need name rehab, but yeah. we gonna see what they got. And one of my viewers actually turned in this song for my motherfucking judgment. So we're gonna see what it's about. No Trace Records taking over. Of course, now in session. They go to law and try to stop the show. <laughs> Fuck them. No Trace TV, our people are head coach. We still train them. We them. We ain't even You see him look on his microphone and shit. Look you fucking pig police. All my niggas soldiers, man, we dangerous What y'all taking over, abandoned house, nigga? She real with us Now, now we getting go, we go You trying to fuck with us All my niggas soldiers run up You gon' feel they cover now We taking over now Yeah, we taking over now They say they got two green dreadlocks What the hell? Look at that nigga hat Look at that nigga hat he got on Trying to sound like somebody else. That's rapping under the influence. I'm gonna have to talk to the state about that. You don't play around, disrespect little head cold, 30 pop a shooting round. Don't fuck with you. We all taking over, abandoned buildings. Disgusted right now yeah. at the fucking video. So fucking disgusting. I mean, it's lack of originality. Okay, lack of bars. You know what I mean? The hook was all right, but the shit went on for seven minutes. I mean, that was just total lack of regard or respect for hip hop and bars right there. There was no bars completely, even though. I thought the beat was cool. I'm gonna have to hit y'all with motherfucking rapping under the age of motherfucking 13. Nigga, all y'all niggas look like y'all was 12. Rapping under the influence of Chief Keith. I totally don't know what to say. Right now, I'm, I'm flabbergasted. Now, you know, I know I was hard on them young bulls, you know what I mean, but you can't really be too mad at them and shit because I can't. I can't really blame them. I gotta blame they, the adults that's around them and shit. Really, I mean, the niggas that's behind them, man, should be motherfucking getting them kids to strive for more better things in life, man. They could be motherfucking, they got a better chance of being a doctor or a lawyer, motherfucking, than being a rap star, nigga. What? I mean, first of all, not charge number one, rapping under the influence of Chief Keith, and he's terrible. Charge number two, you out of Nap Town on 30th and Temple, so we gonna charge up with that. No crack zone. <laughs> All y'all niggas had dreadlocks, so looking like a common nuisance, nigga. <laughs> Not having nothing to do, nigga. Y'all need to go to school. <laughs> y'all niggas need to motherfucking take over a book and try to read the motherfucker. You know what I mean? Is y'all motherfuckers, what grade is y'all niggas in? Like eighth? I tell you what, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm ready to motherfucking make my roll. I'm ready to roll. Looks like we're gonna have to keep the beat around for a couple months to see if some motherfucking more better MCs can get on it and let y'all motherfuckers go on y'all own recognizance. 
So we're gonna have to let y'all go and keep the beat around for a couple months. Next game.